Okay, I'm um, sorry, this is my second attempt making this video. Uh, somehow I was making my first one five minutes into it, my internet connection somehow got cut off and they messed up the video. Um, but as I was saying, my new tablet, eight gigabytes, um, is like over sized. As you can see how big my clock and buttons is, you're supposed to see all four settings. But here you see two clock, and here you see three. And this is the time zone. All the buttons is like all setting. You know, um, trying to get it so you all can see it. And this is setting my time zone. I have to move left and right to scroll up and down. But now when I do click a time zone, I don't know where the button is to uh, to go to the next step on here. It doesn't show. And as I stated in the beginning, I changed my build.prop to the Nexus S build. But instead of just changing just the simple settings, I end up taking the whole thing out now and, and taking a whole Nook tablet build.prob out. Replace that with the full Nexus S build.prob and try to reboot. And what it did was think to thought the whole tablet was a Nexus S. So when it, I guess everything is like oversized or something. And uh, I did make a backup of my build.prob but the only way I could reach the inside of it was to uh, boot up from the SD card, my CM7 off the card, go into uh, ES File Settings, uh, ES File Explorer, and go in there and put the build.pro back. Now I put it back, but it's still not booting up right. So when it, the tablet boots up, it do like the eight fail boots on its own and then it comes to this where I have to re-register and do all this other stuff with it but now I'm stuck so if anybody uh, have a backup that I could use to backup to uh, restore my Nook tablet so I could get it back to the regular screen and then I would just reroute it again you know, um, I'll be really appreciated. And I believe if I could get, push the button, find out where the button is at, I can get into, probably get in here and, and set it. But I don't know where it's at. Where the button's at, it's not showing. Well, nothing move but the scroll bar. Can't touch nowhere. Try to touch the nook button, nook sign, nothing happens. Every every setting is off. You see, I click up here and this changes the, the time zone. It's, it's all off. So, please, if anybody have a backup that I could can have a Nook tablet factory backup. If you backed up yours from root, if you would mind just, you know what I'm saying, emailing me or uh, sending me a link or something, because I do not want to send this back to Nook, to Barnes and Nobles, you know, because that was the only thing that was changed. I tried the... Uh, Unbrick process, uh, the U Ubuntu recovery. But when I when I make that card, that SD card, and put it into the Nook, it won't boot up at all. And I was told that maybe it was corrupt file. But then I did it again, and it still won't boot up. So please, anybody, if you can, help me. 
I would really, really appreciate it. You know, a backup because mine is not backed up. I tried to back it up. It wouldn't back up. I asked for help. You know, I guess that's what they got all these forms out here for and the XDA and, you know, everybody is on the 16 gigabytes and got all the stuff for the 16. But what about the 8 gigabyte? You know, can somebody upload some files to restore it or, you know, y'all do all this, this other development so please somebody help me thank you